Hi my loves, hola mis amores, bienvenidos una vez más a mi canal, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is really special because I'm going to be sharing with you all a big part of my Cuban culture and something that I grew up doing and drinking. In today's video, I'm going to be teaching you how to make Cuban coffee. The first thing you have to make sure that you have is a cafetera cubana. And this is this type of espresso coffee maker that you can find pretty much at any grocery store or any convenience store. And whether it's big or small, you know, it, you just have to make sure that it's an espresso one that looks just like this. And the second thing you need that's extremely important is espresso coffee. In my culture, we have three very specific kinds of brands, and those are Café La Llave, Café Pilon, and Café Bustelo that right now I don't have, but those are the three main brands that we like to use. It doesn't have to be Cuban coffee as long as you have espresso coffee, okay? Make sure that it's really strong and dark. You have to be very careful because Cuban coffee is extremely strong, you guys. I mean, once you try, you're gonna be like, todo el día. Chispita. <laughs> now, the last key ingredient that we need to use for Café Cubano or Cuban coffee is sugar. The other thing you need is a cup, any kind of measuring cup, anything that you can pour the coffee in afterwards. And that's it, my loves. Now we have all the ingredients and we're ready to make our Cafecito Cubano. When you put the water in here, you have to make sure that you fill it up all the way to where this is. And that's the trick to not put too much water or too little water. Okay, so now that we have our cafetera ready, it is time to put it in the cocina. Now, as our coffee is brewing, we're going to go ahead and put five tablespoons of sugar inside of the cup. Okay, so now that the first pizquita came out, I'm going to grab it and put a tiny bit, tiny, tiny little bit, and I'm going to stir it up, stir it up, stir it up, stir it up until it becomes a paste almost. And there you have it, mis amores, cafecito cubano con espumita. And now it's ready to serve and drink. This is it for today's video. I hope you really enjoyed my cafecito cubano and I would love for you to try it at home and comment below if you liked it, if you were able to follow the whole recipe. Remember to subscribe to my channel. Remember to give me a thumbs up if you like this video because that is the best way that you can support me and my channel. I love you so much and I will see you in the next video. So good, salud. Café la llave, café pilón, ¿y cuál es el otro? Bueno, I hope it becomes foam. Baby, the foam came out, the foam came out. Can we do it again?